Good morning, YouTube, and welcome to today's video. Chloe and I have traveled out to the Cotswolds, which is a beautiful part of the UK. Think luscious fields, amazing villages, great pubs, and loads of sheep. <laughs> We've traveled here because we're celebrating Chloe's birthday, which is on the 3rd of June, which is tomorrow. Chloe had no idea we were coming here, but she was really, really, I think, pleasantly surprised because the Cotswolds is beautiful. It's, it's a great place to switch off from like a really hectic, busy life in London. So I think for both of us, it's gonna be a well-needed rest. So we're gonna be celebrating Chloe's birthday. And also, there's one other thing that I need to ask Chloe while we're here. Chloe and I have been together for three years and it's been absolutely amazing. We always have so much fun when we're together and it's difficult to describe besides the cliche that I'm madly in love with her, but there's this feeling that I have inside about her, which is just like this overwhelming desire to want to spend the rest of my life with her. She's amazing. She is incredibly selfless, always thinking about others over herself. And sometimes you have to remind her just to you know, think about yourself once in a while. But people like that are rare in this world, I think. And if you meet someone like that and you're lucky enough to be with them, you should definitely marry them. So that's why I'm gonna ask Chloe to marry me today. So the plan is now to go back to the Airbnb where Chloe may or may not be asleep. We're gonna wake her up, we're gonna grab some breakfast and then we're gonna go on a long walk this morning. We'll then come back to the Airbnb and that's where I'll suggest to Chloe that we should go for a walk. I'll confirm as well with the host of the Airbnb to make sure she stashed us a bottle of champagne. I just hope it's not gonna rain. Apparently there might be thunderstorms this afternoon so that's also a bit of a concern. wildlife <laughs> we're on the Laurie Lee wildlife way walk don't know who that is or what that means but we're walking down so what's happened we're not on the Laurie Lee walk you took us on the midsummer saunter around Laurie's slad okay well the name Laurie still exists somewhat so it's like half relevant it's a it's a shorter walk it's four miles it's not five and a half i don't even think we've got an hour left with this walk all right well we're gonna take it real slow then or should we just walk back up the hill you want to walk back up that hill yeah i don't i don't want to walk back up that hill usually when i organize something it doesn't go right <laughs> Whether it's organizing, cooking, speaking, things just don't really work out. However, this isn't the end of the world because it's so beautiful here that it doesn't really matter if you get lost or you go on the wrong walk. Just walking in general is really nice. Life is a winding road No telling where it goes And I, I really want to know a bit about where we are uh we're on a hill uh i'm not quite sure what hill it is we're on a walk in the Cotswolds. about to go to the pub for lunch we walked up a stream don't even know what else to be where are we <laughs> <laughs> on the top of a hill you said yeah it doesn't really matter does it no nope. great even if I'm falling down, I will keep on searching for my highs. Even if the sky is falling down. As we near the end of our walk, we've covered 10 kilometers, 10,000 steps, and walked a number of different terrain. It was really fun, both extremely hungry. So we've got to our destination, which is the Woolpack Inn, everybody. Sometimes we're crashing down, but we get up and start from the ground. So our pub lunch was delicious, and since then, we've actually driven back to where our Airbnb is, because we're now going on another walk. <laughs> but why not? Exactly, we're here to walk. Yes, we're here to walk 
and be with our sheep friends. Hello, friends. Hello, friends. There are only friends. <laughs> it's true. Are you excited for your walk? I am. Watch out for the poo. So this is the greatest map anyone's ever drawn for us. Oh, it's excellent. <laughs> Where are we? We are somewhere along here. So soon we'll come up to a wood pile and we need to turn left. Can you feel that? Yes, I can. I can feel the rain. I just don't think, it doesn't feel like it's gonna really open up. No, it would be a shame. It would dampen this special occasion. Of woods. Literally all you can hear are the birds. I was going to do a time lapse. It's nice. I like the bird. <laughs> I think it's one. What do you know? It's not good. Well, young. Yeah. Even if the sky is falling down Where should we go? Do you want to go out here? Like out there? Yeah. yeah. Is that why it had to be at four? Yes. <laughs> Our lovely host oh. did that. It's different, which I like, you know. It's not just the same old. No. You let me do it. Yeah. I'm terrified. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> it's the only time I've ever done that. Nailed it. There's a new day that will come again tomorrow There's a new day to take away your sorrow and the old way. I'm going to leave my hand there until you get here to see how right it was How correct am I? You're very correct, oh well my done God. Well done We are engaged <laughs> um, it's weird. It is strange. It's but very... it's not weird. I'm a bit drunk. Yeah, we've both had half um, a bottle, of <laughs> half a bottle of champagne each, and um, a really nice moment. I was like laughing while you were doing. I couldn't believe it. <laughs> yeah. I was like laughing and crying simultaneously. I started to tear up as well. Did you notice? Yeah, I did. I've been rehearsing over and over again getting on one knee and practicing saying it out loud to try and make it feel more natural because it is a very unnatural <laughs> thing to get on one knee but i rehearsed it and i think it, it yeah it went well i was I'm like so crying happy. as soon as you were like down i was like no <laughs> like, no. Mm, i love you i love you there's a new day 